A Russian drone strike on the Ukrainian city of Kharkiv has killed at least seven people, including three children. This according to Ukrainian officials who said that the Iranian-made Shahid drone hit civilian infrastructure, causing a massive fire that burned down 15 private houses. Fire officers went inside the smoldering houses and found the remains of the dead. Officials added that more than 50 people had been evacuated. Ukraine's Air Force said its air defense systems destroyed 23 out of the 31 drones launched overnight. As per the statement, the drones primarily targeted the northeastern Kharkiv region and the southern province of Odessa. The attacks also injured at least four people in Odessa, and that's according to the city's regional governor. The main thing is to save the country, and we will survive the rest. Ukraine comes first. We will defeat all the nastiness from Russia. Ukrainian President Volodymyr Zelensky said in his address that the Russian terrorists will be held accountable. He asserted that in history, the perpetrators of such murders have not gone unpunished. Meanwhile, Moscow says it had repelled an attempted Ukrainian drone attack on Russian civilian transport ships in the Black Sea. Russia's defense ministry said Ukraine had attempted what it called a terrorist attack. It said Russian patrol boats and warplanes averted the attack, destroying one Ukrainian naval drone and disabling the rest. And in a footage released by Russia's defense ministry, Defense Minister Sergei Shoigu was seen visiting a drone production facility as the war nears its two-year mark. The minister declared that there are more advances to come in Russia's special military operations. We On is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news on the move.